with Peter Bell for the Perth Radiological Clinic Injury Update. Belly, both Matt Taberner and Joel Weston made their returns to football at Peel over the weekend. How'd they pull up? Yeah, both players performed well. Matt kicked three goals and, and Joel four. Uh, we're really pleased with how they've recovered. Uh, got a few bumps and bruises, um, but uh, overall uh, it was pleasing to see how they both performed. Josh Tracy, he sustained an ankle injury in that match. What's the update on him? Yeah, really early in the game. Unfortunately for Josh, um, he sustained an injury that's a, a high-grade lateral ligament injury with his ankle and also some bone bruising. There's a lot of swelling there, which is making it uh, a little bit harder to uh, diagnose as well, but that's what we think the damage is. Um, he'll be slow going for uh, hopefully um, a few days, and then um, we're hoping that he might be available in a couple of weeks. And the latest on Nathan O'Driscoll's foot? Yeah, Nathan's got a scan uh, this week. Uh, last time he had the scan, we just needed to see a little more healing. Uh, we're confident that that will be the case this time, and then we can progress to some um, on-field training. Thanks.